Hi, I'm John Storms, and today we're going to do a side-by-side -side comparison of the Falcon F-16 V-5 and the Falcon F-48 V-4, a little compass and contraire. Compass and compare. And before we get into it, uh, give the channel a subscribe, give the video a like, and we'll get started. So here we have the most recent in pixel controllers from Falcon Christmas. We have on this side, the Falcon F48 V4. And on this side, we have the Falcon F16 V5. What's the difference? Why should I pick one over the other? And there are some really good reasons and some significant differences. In general, the Falcon F16 is more for a concentrated display or a concentrated part of your display. You might use both of these in your display, okay? But this is for concentrated lights. There's a lot of lights all in one place. And you have 16 ports that you can bring to bear on a variety of props. And in addition to that, you have um, expansion boards. You can add up two expansion boards and get 48 ports sitting right off of this, right? So that's that's a lot of pixels all in one place. But maybe you have a mega tree. Maybe you have a mega mega tree. Maybe you have a house covered in snowflakes and they you're eating a lot of pixels, right? Or you have you know. But this is for concentrated display. Okay. Now let's say. And the F-16 V-5 does great for that. Um, now, let's say your display is a little different. Maybe you got a big, giant, huge yard. And over in one corner, you know, you got nine tiny reindeer. In another corner, you got some uh, some trees or some singing light bulbs. And in another corner, you got candy canes. But it's all spread out, right? Then the F-16 not the F-16, the F Falcon F-48 is a very good choice because it's good for a distributed display. So you have these 12 ports that you can run a Cat5 cable up to 250 feet and have a receiver board like this one, the SRX-1, or this one, the SRX-2, which is two receivers on one board. But it allows you to say, hey, I'm going to have four or eight ports way over there and then way over there and it allows you to get a lot more distance away from the controller okay so the f48 works really well in a situation where your display is more distributed and the f16 works well for things that are more concentrated now the cool thing about the f6 the f48 is that they now include doo -doo -doo onboard pixels so it's almost like its own differential now technically these ports are the same as this port, right? So whatever, you know, you send out to this differential is going to be mirrored onto these four ports. But still, great option, okay? Um, so that's the, the main difference, right? These are both made by Falcon Christmas. They run um, probably, I mean, I haven't looked at the source, but I got to imagine it's almost identical. Um, and it uses the same protocols and everything else. So super nice, uh, super nice setup. I've been using the Falcons for years. I had the V3 version of this, which I think was the first version of the F48. And I've been running uh, Falcons since, uh, since the very beginning. Um, and they're, uh, they're wonderful boards, very solid boards, and uh, they do well. Unless, of course, you get a direct lightning strike, then nothing will save you. Okay, so those are the main differences. Both of them have a DMX out port, which you can use to control something like, you know, a bracelet transmitter or some lighterama devices. They both have inputs, right, so that you can hook them up to buttons and that sort of thing. You know, everything else is is pretty much the same. So there's your pros. There's the, the main differences between the F48 and the F16. Hope that helps.